There will soon be a new person driving the Via Metropolitan Transit Agency. Hope Andrade's time as Via Board Chairwoman ends November 30th, this coming Monday. A replacement still needs to go through a nomination and confirmation process with the rest of the board. But the mayor and county judge have provided their recommendation. Local businessman and former Hispanic Chamber of Commerce chairman and Fiesta Commission president Fernando Reyes. Garrett Berger spoke with Reyes about his plans if the board should agree to put him at its head. The chairman of two parts supplier companies for Toyota and the treasurer of the political action committee linked to the successful sales tax campaign for transit, Fernando Reyes was tapped by County Judge Nelson Wolf and Mayor Ron Nuremberg to lead the agency that sales tax will benefit. What I can tell, uh, it, it's a fantastic board that I'm going to be working with and I look forward to working with each and every one. The tax money will begin rolling in in 2026. Via CEO has said the new revenue would help the agency increase bus service in the core service area, expand mobility options further out, and begin planning for an advanced rapid transit system. Speaking with KSAT today, Ray has indicated he plans to continue along that path, which outgoing chairwoman Hope Andrade helped champion. I think that's what the citizens of San Antonio passed. I don't think I'm, I'm going in there to change that. Uh, and my whole point would be, is there somebody, is there something that we could do more effectively within the mandates that the citizens of San Antonio gave us and the leaders of, of our city? Ray has said he has spoken with Andrade, though not other board members. And when pressed about any changes or new directions he might have for VIA, Ray has declined to answer saying he wanted to have the opportunity to speak with other board members first. And so I want to listen to them before I start throwing out mandates and changes or whatever. Without mentioning Reyes by name, Andrade gave a statement to KSAT saying in part, quote, as my tenure scheduled to end on November 30th, I'm looking forward to seeing a continuation of the work we began with a newly elected chair for whom I wish the success and fulfillment I enjoyed during my time in service. Garrett Berger, KSAT 12 News.